I can't think of a better way to start a season off than starting it off in the AFC Champions League. Let's get into it, my dudes. Before we get into today's episode, why don't you go ahead and leave a thumbs up, subscribe, hit that notification bell, and leave a comment down below. We're starting off in the Champions League, going up against Tampines, a team that we have played before. I'm not exactly sure where they're from again. I can't remember. Uh, Singapore, they're not a very good side. We're just going to play them one time on screen, and the main reason why we're playing them today is because, well, it is the start of a brand new season here at Daegu, and I'm I'm excited about it. As you can see, looking at their star ratings, it's a, it's a really, really poor team. Uh, we should win this one pretty handedly. Looking at their key player, it's this guy right here. And he does have some attributes. He's he's a really, actually physically, he looks to be a decent player. Uh, his mental ability, he's got some good mental ability as well. So uh, I'm, I'm not worried about this team. I think we should be able to beat him. We are going to play a little bit of a rotated side, playing some of these youngsters that we haven't seen before and mixing in some of the, the guys that we've had in the past that's been on the bench that hadn't played a ton. So... It is going to be interesting to see how this match goes. We're not bringing our A team against them. So I am a little bit nervous on that end, but I think we have enough in the side to pick it up. Uh, enough in, on this side to win this match. I'm, I'm actually just going through to make sure I don't, didn't miss anything. And I don't really think we have. We haven't done anything really. We still have some money. Not much. We do have some. We're, we're a little bit higher on the payroll than where I want. We got a lot of transfer budget still left over, but I really don't plan on spending that. It's, it's, uh, it's way more than what we need. We I don't think we signed anybody else. It's been a couple days since I've played this save because I've been uploading the KB Mecklen stuff over the weekend. Yeah, we only signed the three players this offseason, so they're all ready to go. Uh, we're playing... I don't think we're playing any of them today. We may be playing Yoon Jin Wook. I'm not 100% sure. I think that's what we're doing. I think we're just playing one of them. So... Uh, I think we're ready to get into this match. The second one we're going to be playing is going up against Jeju United, who's a, who's a pretty good team. We never looked at this either. Let's take a look at the season preview, seeing where we're going to project it to finish. We're projected to finish third uh, behind John Book and Poeng. Our usual, it's the usual teams. It's the usual rivals that we play against. We, we, we hate we hate Poeng Steelers, though. They're a, they're a tough side against us that we, we usually have to struggle with. Looking at the, the thing here. The Media Dream 11. We have Kim Chol Ho in there and Kim as well. So good to see Kim Chol Ho, the 19-year-old kid, making it making an impact in, on the team and making it into the Media Dream 11. We also didn't go over our number 20 this year. It's once again Kim. Kim is going to be our number 20. Uh, main reason why is he's a good leader in the team. He's a really good player as well. So there you go. That's what more reasons do you need than that right there? I think I think it's a great thing for him. 22 caps for the for his nation. He's just a really good player, isn't he? He's been here with us since the start of the save, and he is not disappointed. He's only gotten better, really. He'd had a little bit of a dip last year compared to the year before, but at a 7.0 rating, I'll take that any day of the week. Any day of the week. Looking at the side, this is where it's getting interesting. Because I am thinking about doing something that's really different. Because as you can see, we're playing with a rotated side. Our midfield's not rotated. It's it's still our core group of guys right now that we want out there. But I am debating Owen coming on. I think we're going to give Owen a shot in goal today. And we are going to change up the midfield just a little bit. We could bring uh, Choi Young-Ho on. I think it's Choi, ain't it? Choi's a pretty good player. Yeah, Choi is a really good player. So we're going to put him in instead of Kim Chan, so... So we do have a little bit of a rotated side, as I said, but there is some people that we know out there. Owen is in goal. We got a back four of Shim, Lee Wong Jin, Han Bin, Wong Jin Wook. Man, these are this this back four is a lot different than what it usually is. In the midfield, we got Kim Chol Ho, Park Jong, and Choi Young Ho. Right hand side, Coldified. Left hand side, Helgeson. Up top, Wallace is getting the start over Jung. I just want to see what he can do. I want to see what he can do in the, in the Champions League. I want you guys to actually be able to see him as well. If you don't remember Lee Yung Jin as well, he's a 17 year old kid that we brought up from our reserve team. Thought I hit career stats. He's been with here. He came through the youth intake. I want to see what he can do in the Champions League. Just, I mean, is, he's an option for us. We, we've got we got some guys, but theoretically what I would like is him to be our third choice instead of Han Ben. Because Han Ben's going to be needed on the wings as well on, at, at, at fullback. So, um, yeah, I think that's the plan with the team going forward. We're starting Coldify over Kim Young-min just because I think Coldify is a little bit of a better player 
I want to see something from him, and I want to see some stuff from Kim Young Min. We may see him in the second match. I'm not sure yet. We got three players making their debut though, so it's it's going to be a tough one for them. I'm I'm, I'm interested to see how that that plays out with the team that we're not we're, we're a lot better than, but it's still an AFC Champions League matchup. Should be winning it comfortably though. I want to see something from Josh Wallace though. I chose him over the I think he's is he. He's Danish. I, I chose him over the Danish striker that we have also for our third roster spot that's foreign players. And as you remember, there's our team, our group stage that we're going up against. Cows Hockey Front Tail, Melbourne Victory, and Tam Pines. It's a little bit tougher of a, a, a draw this time with Cows Hockey Front Tail, who we, we were better than. And, uh, but they're, but they're still, they've still got talent on their team. And same with Melbourne Victory coming from Australia. Got to watch some of these teams. So I feel like this is a good chance to get some of these debuts out of the way. Some of these youngsters, see if they can do anything for the side. That's what we're going to hope happens. Looks like we're going to have a set piece here. I'm guessing this is Cole to fight to take. He's going to go on goal. Gets his first of the season. It's 1-0. I mean, that was easy, wasn't it? That was an easy one. Good stuff, though. Hey, we're not complaining here. Definitely not complaining. We want to definitely get our... Uh, our goals in this match to help with the goal differential in the group stage. And, and we can definitely do it against this team. They're not, they're not a very good side. But I'm, I'm liking what I'm seeing. I wish, I think what we're going to do is we're going to shout at Josh Wallace a little bit, give him a little bit of encouragement. Okay. Uh, that's not what I, I wanted. I know there's a highlight going on. I apologize. I'm sorry. Sorry. Okay. Don't be mad at me. Encourage. Josh Wallace. There we go. Does anybody else ever use individual shots? I hardly ever do it. Doesn't seem like it's done anything if, 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 if it's even went into effect yet. That's cleared out. Lee Young Jin with it. Plays it up to Kim Chol Ho. Park Zhong back to Kim Chol Ho. We're going to do a little bit of a zoom. Nope. Can't zoom in. Shim J Min with the ball. Gets it into Helgeson, who gets his first of the season. Shim J Min's on the assist. It's 2 0 now. Lovely stuff by the guys. Now, I wanted to get that uh, debut out of the way for Wallace against a really poor side, and, and I, think, I think we've done that here. Very nice. Okay, apparently encouraging Josh Wallace did not help. Did not help at all. I'm sorry, Josh. Don't be mad at me. Lee Yoon Jin playing this ball. He's looking for Wallace. Can't quite get it to him. Tampines main, gets possessions here. And they're looking to get a little bit of a counterattack going here. We need to get a stop on this. There's a lot of space right here. Guys, uh, there we go. Don't know who you are. Who are you? Han Ben done a good job to get back on that. Okay, you don't have to stay on him. Helgeson with the ball. Playing it back to Han Ben. Park Jong with it. Kim Ch to Choi Young Ho. Helgeson now. Running down the left-hand side. Cuts it inside. Takes a shot. And it's not a very good one, is it? I'm happy with the side so far. I would wish that Josh was, Wallace was doing a little bit better than what he is, but it's a debut. He's still, still trying to figure it out. We're going to pump the fist. There's room for improvement. Hey, Josh, I believe in you. He's inspired and motivated. Maybe he can get a goal here in the second half for us. We're dominating, though. It's good stuff. I, I would like to be up more than 2-0, though, really, against this side. I mean, we should be up. A lot more than this. I know we're playing a rotated side, but it's still a very weak side that we're playing. And it's been good that we haven't had a set Owen's name. That's that's nice when your when your goalkeeper is not even getting really challenged. Elgerson with the ball dodges a tackle there. He's got Wallace. He takes the shot himself. He gets a brace. Lee Yoon Jin on the assist. Three nil now, and that was lovely stuff by Helgeson. Had kind of a disappointing season last year. He uh, had an opportunity to be the number one left wing for a little bit. Couldn't quite pull it off uh, because of injuries. He got moved over there to be the number one. When, help, when we got healthy again, he immediately fell out of the starting lineup. And uh, hopefully we can see a big upgrade in him this year. I would love to see that between him and Wallace a little bit. Just to see if, like, just uh, them two guys getting better. You know, because I feel like they are not big ticket items, but they are guys that we eventually can sell for some money, hopefully. With, with Wallace being English, I, I think that's, that's very nice. 
Flag, flag. Okay, okay, okay. Owen, got a little bit worried there. Got a little bit worried. I mean, yeah, yeah, okay. Nothing to be worried about. Lee Yoon Jik is getting... I, I, I totally messed up his name, didn't I? Lee, I can't remember his name. It's, it's one of the Lees now. We've got a bunch of Lees and a bunch of Kims. And uh, it's the left back Lee. I can't, can't think of his last name. We're going to be putting in a new player for him, though, pretty soon after this highlight's over with. Wallace with his first attempt, and it's deflected off of the fender. Uh-oh, that's a dangerous flick backwards. Run, Han Bin. Thank you, sir. Owen with the ball. Plays it over to Han Bin. Park Jong with it now. Kim Chol Ho, who is on a card. Park Jong gets it now. He's running down the middle with it. He gets it up to Wallace. Back to Chol Ho. Shim J Man on the ball now. Crosses it in. He's looking for Elgison's head, and he gets it to him, but it sells over the top. All right, it's time to make some changes. We got some players getting a little bit tired out there, so we're going to go ahead and do that. Lee, Woon, Lee Jin Wook. I'm sorry, I, I did not think of his name. I really don't have a player for him. On Ben's going to slot over. Sam's going to come in. Do we have another like defensive player that we could bring on that? I mean, I would really like that, but we don't, unfortunately. Elgison's on a brace. Lee Min Wu. We could bring him on. I'd like to see him play a little bit. I think our final change will probably be Kim Young Min unless somebody else gets tired. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not going to be able to do nothing about Lee Yoon Jin. I would like to get him off since he's tired, but it's, it's not going to happen, unfortunately, for him. He's going to have to finish the match out for us. I think we dropped some praise on the guys. They're playing wonderful out there today. Wallace, with his first, with the club, good stuff there. Coldifies on the assist, 4-0 now. This is what I wanted from this match. It's good to see some debut scoring right here from Wallace. Good stuff there. We brought him in. I chose him over the Danish guy, and I, I think I made the right decision. It's just one of those things we're going to have to wait it out to see if we did. Coldify, you've had an excellent game, but I'm taking you off for Kim Young min 4-0. Very, very nice. Young min plays it back to Shim J Man, who works it in the box. It's Helgeson's pushed down. We're going to let Helgeson take this. He's on a brace right now, trying for a hat trick here. And he doesn't get it. It stopped. It's a bit disappointing. I was hoping he could get it there for us. And for him as well. It'd be his first hat trick with the club. Young men taking this corner. Not really threatening, is it? It's played back out to Kim Young Min, who has another chance to work it in the box, and he deflects it off a defender instead. And Tampines going to run it down. They are wanting to get at least one goal out of this match. Hopefully we get a stop here and don't allow that. Han Bin has had a really good game. And he just pushes that ball out, stopping the, the counterattack there and ending the highlight. Good stuff by him. Three minutes of added time. And we're going to get out of here with a W. Sitting top of the table, 4-0 victory over Tampines. Now, granted, that was the easiest matchup we've got against in our group stage. We've got, I really do feel like this is probably our toughest group stage that we've been in. I'm saying that, but I still think we should win pretty easily in these matches, but I do believe it's it's one of our tougher ones. We, we struggled, I think, our first time around with Kawasaki front tail. The team's got better, and then anytime you're playing a team in Australia, I'm a little bit nervous because there is some talent there, unlike against Singapore. I think this is where Tampines was, but that's lovely. That's lovely stuff. Putting us top of the table. Up next, we got Jeju in the league. Hopefully, we'll get off to a good start of it. Our lineup will be more normal than what it was right there. Wallace scores on his debut. Good stuff. 50K. Kim J Min. Please, or who's Kim J Min? He's one of our, we've got two assistant managers, by the way. And uh, Helgeson was the man of the match. Two goals for him. A hey, great job. Well, in the second match against Jeju, I think we're going to go with our best 11, I guess you could say. We got Son in goal, back four of Kim, Lee Won Chik, Sam, and Woon Jik Woo. In the midfield, we got Kim Chol Ho, Kim Chan So, Park Jong, right hand side. We got Coldify, left hand side, Kim Sung Ko, and up top Jung. I know we mentioned starting Kim Young Min in this match, but I thought Coldify looked really, really well in the last match. And I think it's a little bit wrong for us to go ahead and take him out of the lineup. So he's going to get a run of, go, run of games here, I think. And then it, it really sucks for uh, Helgeson because he looked really good in the last match. He looked really good. And uh, Kim, Sung -ho, Kim Sung Ho comes in and takes his place. I've actually been sitting here trying to think of a way we could bring him on. 
I think we take Li Yung Jin off and bring him in that way. Because I would like to play him at some point during this match just because he looked so good. He had a brace in the match. I know it was a, a smaller team like we've, we've said it many times in today's episode, but he looked really good, didn't he? We're going to pump our fist. Come on, guys. Show me what you can do. We've got some of our more important players in there, our more highly influential players. And I want to see what they can do. I want to see what Kim Chan So can do this year. I want to see what Kim Sung... Kim Sung Ho, uh, I know what Kim Sung Ho can do. I want to see what Jung can do after his bad performance last year. Kim Chan So is somebody we're going to have to keep an eye on because he is getting older. I mean, I don't think he's like super old, but he's 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 an old man of our group. So as you guys know, once they get thirty, I'm shipping them out usually. So hey, bud, you got to pay attention. Sam, his contract's up at the end of the year, and I don't know if I'm going to resign him or not. I'm really excited with Lee Won Shik. And uh, the other guy that we played in the last match, I think they're going to be really good players for us in the future. So Sam may be getting sold at the next transfer window. That's, that's the idea. I would really like to sell him at the next transfer window. Someone with the safe hands here. And I've always been really impressed with Jeju Stadium. I think it's a, it's a nice stadium. I mean, it's, it's massive, ain't it? Wish we had something like that. Hey, we do have something massive, but we don't play in it. Jung with the ball now. It's his first look of this season. Can't get around the man. It gets closed down rather quickly. Is he going to get us a pin here, though? Looks like he may. And uh, I want to see who do we have taking the pins? Who who can we bring in? Uh, I mean, Kim Chan So is calm, and he's pretty good at pins. So I think we're going to play him on this one. If it comes down to a pin, it may not. Hopefully it does. Maybe it'll give us an early lead. We missed our last pin. Kim Chan So's taking it. Do a little zoom in job now. He steps back. And he buries it, putting us up 1-0. The veteran of the group gets his first of the season. And it's our first league goal as well. Lovely stuff there by him. He's a good player, isn't he? He's one of those guys, like I know I've mentioned him in the past. So let's take a brief look at him. He's 26, and I'm like, he's an old man. I thought he was closer to 30. Not going to lie to you guys. Flair of 17, leadership of 19, work rate of 16. That work rate and that leadership, that is hard to come by. I don't know what my dogs are doing down there. That was kind of odd. I'm, I'm hold, hold, please. Well, I do apologize for that. The dog, I don't know... If one of if they kind of like sat on each other and they made a noise because one of them acted like she didn't like something. So I went ahead and I just put them up till we get done with the video. That way I don't have to worry about them uh, going in the other room and drinking to God knows how long. But uh, where are we at? We're in the match. We was looking at Kim Chan So. Time to get back in the match. I, I feel like Kim Chan So is better than three stars. Like, uh, I was really hoping we could leave him on. I seen that he get picked up a knock earlier, but he didn't have the the injured sign, so I left him on. Helgeson's coming on. I'm not really worried about that change. Like I said, Helgeson looked really good in the last match. Hopefully, him getting some minutes in this match as well kind of gets him into a little bit of good form here. Playing it forward, he's trying to get Jung on a run, but Jung Jung just ain't doing it. He said no. I'd run when I decide to run. This Jeju side was more of a, what's it? There was more of a surprise last year. They played really good. Kim does a wonderful job there, taking that ball away. It's played back to Son, Sam with it. Back to Son again. Back to Sam. They're playing back and forth. They don't know who wants it. I didn't like that. I mean, I know that we're supposed to look for counters, but that was, that was poor. 1-1. Not the way we want to get the league started. I'm, I'm half tempted because it doesn't seem like they're really pressure, pressuring us that much. I'm trying to find it. Yeah, they're not really pressuring us, pressuring us that much. So we're going to uh, start distributing to our fullback or our center bases. Instead of uh, playing it forward, I think. I kind of want us just to counter when we win the ball from now on. Like I, I think we're good enough of a team to build from the back going forward. But, yeah, that was 
That was disappointing. So hopefully turning that on will help out. That way we're not trying to play that immediate long ball when it's not there. Kim Chan, so getting it into Kim, who gets his first of the season. Kim and Kim linking up on that one, 2-1. Kim Chan, so was on the assist right before halftime. That's a wonderful time for Kim to come in there and score for us. And we know how good of a player he is. He plays in that right back spot for us, but he can play anywhere on that right-hand side. He's, he's such a good player. And Kim Chan, so doing what he does, getting the assist, Lovely stuff there. We're going to watch this right here, though, from Jeju right before half. Sam does a wonderful job saying, no, 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 coldify to chase it down. Having a bit of a disappointment match, disappointing match compared to the last one. It looks like he has Jung running if he wants to cross it into him. He waits a little bit long, doesn't he? But Jung, he gets his first of the season as well. Coldifies on the assist, 3-1. Lovely stuff. Two goals right before the half. And Jeju are backtracking now. Good stuff here about the guys. I wish we could have kept, kept, kept uh, Kim Sung Ho on a little bit longer. I would have liked to seen him today. Unfortunately, doesn't happen for us. Good stuff. Good half. There's room for improvement, though. There's always room for improvement. All right, so I think at some point we'll take off Kim Cho Ho since he's on a card. You might come off if we have that backup left back on the bench. I'm not sure if we do or not. But this has been a good this has been a good league match for us. Zoom it back out a little bit till they throw it in. All right, now we're back in where we want to be. Kim Chan So does a wonderful job just stealing that pass. We don't really do anything with it, do we? Jeju with the ball. We looked a little bit too hard for that counter there, didn't we? Saw him not having a good game. Allows the second one to go in today. Two three. You know, we're going to try something, and it's really going to change what we've done a lot this season. I keep pushing my glasses up on my forehead. Like, I'm aware that I'm doing that, and I don't know why I keep doing it. We're going to take counter off. We're not going to tell them to hold shape, but just kind of, kind of do what you want to do. Let's see how that works out for us, because I feel like the two times they've scored on us has been us trying to counter and it not working out for us. Yoon Jin Wook. Stealing that pass or heading that pass forward. It ends up in Jeju's possession, though. Kim doing a good job of tightly marking that guy. Kim Chan So almost picks another pass. Jeju making another run here. And that guy is really hurting us. I have no idea how you say his name, but definitely, definitely hurting us. I wanna I wanna do something to him because he's he's looking quite well, isn't he? We're gonna tightly mark him. Because he, he's, he's been pretty threatening. He got, he's got both of their goals, yeah. I thought he had. All right, Kim Cho Ho's, he's tired. He's on a card. We're going to go ahead and take, make that change. Choi Young Ho coming on for him. I'm not going to make another change yet. I don't have that left back. I, I'm really wanting to play him, but I don't have him. Dang. Way to go, Breck. Kim Chan So also getting tired. He may have to stay on just a little bit longer. Our midfield's tired. Just the whole the whole group. All right, so we're going to make a change here. Kim Chan So is going to come off. I think. Yeah, unfortunately, it's going to be Kim Min Woo coming on for him. We don't really have another defensive player that can play in the midfield. I would like to take Park Jong off as well, but we don't have that option, unfortunately, for us. And I'm looking at the bench, and I don't really see another change that I'm I'm just – Thrilled to make. I mean, what we could have done was hold up. Han Ben coming on. Going with a flat back five. Something like that. And just putting you as a deep line on defend. What do we think about that? Kind of like it. To try preserving this lead over these last couple minutes, we're going to make one more change to the team. Slowing the pace down. It's this one, ain't it? Yeah. And we're going to turn that down. I think we're going to make some tactical changes between episodes. I want to kind of see if we can go to a... We've tried it in the past with the control position. I kind of want to go back to that. See if we can get it to work for us. I think we're good enough. Four minutes of added time. We get out with a victory. It was a narrow one. It was a little bit closer than what we wanted. But I think we made it easier for Jeju than 
them doing good against us, if that makes sense. I feel I don't feel like Sloan had the best of games. The one guy he kept getting low, he kept we kept losing him. I think we could have done better than that. A good win though, nevertheless. Gives us three points, and that's a good way to start the season. A win in the group stage and a win in the league. You gotta love it. Well, as I just said, it's always good to get off to two straight victories like we did. If you enjoyed this episode, leave a thumbs up, subscribe, hit that notification bell, and leave a comment down below. And as always, my dudes, thank you for watching.